Hey, mates. I'm Ninlos, and welcome back to a rousing game of Fire Emblem Three Houses. Getting it again. In between yesterday's stream of this, the test stream, and today, I decided to finish up a couple of more practice battle things. And so, we won't have to worry about that too over much. Anyway, this time I have uh, myself logged in Discord just in case any of my friends decide to join me here today for some reason. Anyway, we can jump. Let's go slide this way. I probably shouldn't say that too much, but I actually have something to do to my side. Anyway. Well, let's instruct manually. We won't be able to do too much instruction, unfortunately, because we only have two people that are able to learn anything. In terms of instruction, but we can correct that by the time we get to... Well, another day where we're able to do so. Let's instruct. Do time. So I plan on training to do in being able to punch really good and to axe really good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start... Actually, before I do any of that... I'm going to pump this leadership up to E+. Plus. I answered correct. It's in my grasp. And we got perfect. No need for praise. Hell yes. This means we can train him further. And there's two of you here. Welcome. I have Don't worry. We're advancing. Keeping my understanding. It seems I've improved. Yes, you have. And we can only train in that again here. I want to increase her axing skills so that there's a certain weapon that you can get later that uses together. axe skill, but it's a magic weapon, so we don't have to worry too much about her strength. Anyway, let's uh, let's start cranking up her faith. Or no, her. We can do reason for. And if we get it perfect, hell yes. Get it. Thanks for your time. And she'll definitely get seat rank now. Hell yes. Am I making? And we can't try anyone else. Let's begin the lecture. Professor. Oh yeah, that makes sense. We'll crank up her authority, or in the off time zone. And Mercedes would like to speak with me. Cool. Good evening, Professor. Returning from work, I take it? I commend you for working so late into the evening. All of my days at the Academy are enriching thanks to you. That's nice. Try not to overtax yourself, alright? I'm concerned for your health. We wouldn't want you to wear yourself out. The Goddess won't smite you if you rely on others for help, you know. Listen here, turn Professor. Bond. You might not like what I'm about to say. To be perfectly honest, I had my doubts when I first met you. Of course. At first, I thought you seemed too young to be a professor. It is unusual, you have to admit. Yet, you seemed very composed and mature despite your age. You're strong-willed, encouraging, and you go to great lengths to ensure that everyone is cared for. But it almost feels like you're trying too hard to be a perfect role model for your students. Well, I do have to be perfect. Uh, we're gonna say I'm not trying too hard, I think. If that's how you feel, then I can't disagree. But I think it's necessary to give yourself a break every now and again. The mind has a tendency to make mistakes when you've exhausted yourself. In my case, I still seem to make mistakes even when I'm wide awake. Oh, you know, I'm always 
Mixing up the dates for drills or misplacing things. Just the other day, I forgot to put on my uniform and headed out to practice wearing only my... Oh, God. Oh, um, well, you can imagine how embarrassed I was. My mind can be so scattered sometimes. Well, then. Anyway, where was I? Ah, oh, that's right. What I'm trying to say is that you shouldn't push yourself too hard. If you do, you might end up in a pretty bad place. That reminds me. Is there anything I can do to assist you, Professor? If it's all right with you, I'd like to help in any way I can. Whatever you need, just say the word. Yes. I look forward to helping you out. Hell yes. It's a me. It's very real. And do wants me. Wants to do a thing, I guess. Did there was a lot something? of bonding time that occurred during those battles. I see. If you have the time, then please assist me. I am to water the flowers in the greenhouse. Thank you. Time to water some flowers. Only do not water the ones in that corner. They are from Dusker. They require a dry environment. The roots will rot otherwise. Yes, they are. Yes. And scowl time. I owe you a debt of gratitude. In both the extracurricular activities here at the Academy and on the battlefield, your presence has been instrumental in the defense of His Highness. You have my sincerest thanks. I see. Hmm. Or was quiet. there something else you wanted? Then please, excuse me. He's difficult to hold a conversation with, I guess. It's weird. He is pumped up. St. McKeel Day is today. It'll be him or Selma the Cathedral to participate. I always say yes to these things. Because they're important. Regardless of the quality, this is a good chance for us to prove our solidarity. It's hard to sneak out when the professor is watching. Of course. Bonds have grown stronger. Those are faith. Be humanity and otherwise. Oh god. I'm triggering all the sport combos because <laughs> the third accident. Time this month. <laughs> well, that's that. Father never relents. Oh, Professor. Hello. Did you need something? Uh. Well, um, that is. I was just tossing out something I have no need of. It's important to keep our spaces clean after all. You'd do well to remember that too, Professor. A clean space makes for a clean mind, or some such. Well, Getting rid of things you have no need for is the first step to managing one's belongings in an economical way. That seems like it'd be a bad idea. Does that surprise you? Perhaps it seems ill-befitting someone of noble birth to care about such things. Despite my family's nobility, we have never been particularly wealthy. So my father raised me to be conservative with my resources, paring down when necessary. He also encouraged me to keep my living spaces immaculate. So the two go hand in hand, I suppose. Well then. Yes, he's 
a good person. Yeah, sure. Even when managing our territory used up most of our family's resources, he still went out of his way to ensure my comfort. Oh, uh, just a scrap of paper. Yeah, paper. That's it was what already I want. written on, so no good for note taking. And obviously, I can't use it to clean my lance. So I tossed it. No need to hang on to inconsequential things, you know. Well, Professor, did you come to check on me for any particular reason? I hope Sylvain and Felix aren't getting into trouble as they tend to do. They get in a lot of trouble, don't they? We'll say that last one. Oh, well, if there is nothing important, I'll be on my way then. I still have some cleaning to take care of, after all. Talk to you later, Professor. Of course. C. Oh no. Another support convo. Inbound. <laughs> you think I'd cheat? On you, baby? Never. Come on. You should know me better than that. Oh no. You're the only one for me. It's so I bad. Swear. Hey, if you don't believe me, well... Oh, I get it. If I'm not your type, do you want me to introduce you to some other guys who have crests? They're all nobles, just like me. That's a suspicious what? thing to bring up. That isn't why I'm <laughs> you. You're worse than I thought. I just want you to be happy. You know, get what you're after. A crest. I hate seeing a girl cry. Especially one as beautiful as you. <laughs> so, you know, maybe we... <sighs> Very heavy-handed. So, Professor... Do you enjoy spying on people? You look like you've got something to say. So say it. Hey, that was between me and her, not you. But you know how it is. Most relationships, they end in heartbreak. Uh. Anyway, I don't know why she's so upset about me dating other girls. She didn't care before she found out, so that's why does she care uh, now? kind of a weird <sighs> way of seeing, seeing it, Sylvain. Believe whatever you want, but I'm honestly not sure if I can ever love again. Oh no. Well, I think I he's the George best way Michael of this game. Heart is to head out on the town. Why don't you join me? Who knows? Maybe you'll find love. I mean, I know I will. <laughs> Calm down. It was only a joke. You've really got no sense of humor. You know that. <laughs> well, it increased support regardless. That was a little rough. <laughs> Seems we finally finished. That's it. I'm done. No more work for me. Especially not with her. Not in a million years. Oh, shut up, son. It was good flying, though. I've got it. He knows how to punch good. Am I starting to master this? He can axe. <laughs> I'm a natural. He's next. I'm getting the hang of this. Yes. Ooh. Everyone can take beginner exams now. So about beginner exams, you can get them to take. A uh, test to get a new class. That said, we're gonna work on Ingrid first. Bring her a little bit, both in sword and lance. I give her Mirbadin. That way, we can train her speed a bit. I must continue to work hard. Make her Mirabedin. Go. So then, I'm gonna make him a fighter this time. I had uh, made him a soldier, like in one of the previous playthroughs, but I'm gonna make him a fighter too. I know it's not exactly the best with his lance usage, but 
the strength boost we need. Huh, okay. No big deal, really. We are going to... I'm also going to uh, upgrade Ash to Fighter. As his bow usage is best for that sort of thing. Oh, what a relief! And we make Mercedes a Do, do, do. I'm so glad I passed. Yes. And do I have any more? Well, if we do, Mirabadin. I almost want to go fighter with him this time, but eh, we'll do Mirabadin again. Everybody intends to work out pretty well for me, honestly. It's a me! Everybody didn't know. New path to, path to tread. Yes. And now we're gonna go buy more of those beginners. Oh, that's Leave, I want to buy. Four more, I think? I think that's what. Let's see. Yeah, it is four more I want to get. I'll make him a soldier. Results. Like to do a fight man as fight men what he does best. And he gained a stat bonus from fighter. I passed. One additional res. Okay. <laughs> I think for Felix. He's kind of a monster already. I don't know if Fighter would be a great idea. But actually, you know what? I could work on his bow proficiency while we're at this, so let's make him a fight now. Well. Felix the Fighter. Don't worry, you'll only be here for like, Easy. maybe five levels. And we'll... Gonna make her a monk, as per usual. Fast. It's all thanks to hard work. Hell yes. Everyone has passed. And now we have the seminar. Alright. Seminar time. Those lovely seminars are these high skilled instructors gain more experience to those who attend. You'll cho choose to attend a seminar based on well the subject matches or skill goals. Those high motivation will like you to attend. Alright. So, going to do is I'm actually going to... Hmm. Regardless of what we do, three people that will gain motivation will show up, so... That has 
appliances and authority. He has a higher rank than we have currently in any of that. Hanuman has a D and a C. Wouldn't benefit Ash too much. And Manuel has a D and a C. Wouldn't benefit Felix too much. I think we're going to get a lesson from Seth himself. For this one. That way our authority increases by a decent amount. Hell yes. Each new experience is an asset. Everyone's a better leader. Got it. Good to go. I'm certain I've improved. Yes. I definitely want Ingrid to improve on her uh authority. For reasons later. For Sam's birthday. Yes. Professor, I just got word from the Knights that the last of the thieves have been cornered. Just as planned. They're in Xanadu, the Red Canyon. We certainly can't allow those underhanded thieves to get away. Let's work together and do our best to take them down. Yes. It matters not who we're up against. They will not harm His Highness. <laughs> we're just fighting common thieves, right? I don't expect much of a challenge. Aren't you a spoil sport? I'm actually quite excited myself. Who knows? There may even be some cute lady thieves. Damn it, Sylvain. Hmm. Now's not the time well, to have your mind in the cutter. Real battle is a great opportunity for us to see how far we've come. All right, it's true. a lot of you here. Wow. A success, Welcome. We'll be fine so long as we to this place. strange uh, land. Perhaps we are a bit overly excited, but remember that we have the knights on our side. All should be well. Ah. Yes. And speaking of the knights. I heard that Gerald is once again one of the Knights of Seros. Perhaps we'll have the good fortune of seeing you two fight side by side. I'm sure you will. Oh, of course. I apologize for letting my childish whims get the better of me. Have them while you still have them, honestly, Dimitri. I'm a bit jealous. My parents are no longer around. They... they died. Both oh. That's I'm all that depressing. Now. Anyhow, I'm sorry to bore you with such things. I should probably clarify, this I'd is not a blind playthrough. Part, I have done professor? this route before, but as the female professor. So, as a male man, there are some things I do not know yet. But, you know. Neither here nor there. Point is, everyone has their classes of choice. And to play. And I guess since I want to work on Felix's bow skill, what I want to do, I'm actually going to end up configuring my inventory. We have support conversations. I think I might as well get them out of the way now while we can. Your Highness, the hour is late. May I ask where it is you're going? I'm off to the library for a bit of research before I train. After that, a bath and bed. Hmm, some Very frames well. dropped. Eh, I whatever. shall accompany you. Okay, problem. Uh, no. There's no need for that. I am a grown man, after all. You sustained an injury during yesterday's training. My presence may be of use to you. It was a mere bruise that will heal in no time. No need to fret over me to do. Are you dissatisfied with me, your highness? Please do not hesitate to correct me. And there it is again. Oh no. Yes? What is it? Well, you often choose to address me as your highness. When we first met, you used to call me by my name. That was because I was unfamiliar with Fodlin's speech. Thinking back, such rude manners were inexcusable. To be honest, I much preferred it. I feel more comfortable being addressed by my name, rather than with the honorifics that go along with being a prince. But... I did not teach you to read and write so that you'd know how to address me properly. And I brought you to the academy as my friend, not a vassal. But your highness, a vassal is precisely what I am. So much has happened since we met, yet we cannot seem to bridge this gap. So be it. I give you leave to return to your quarters. Take an early night and reflect on what I've said. 
Please. I couldn't possibly. I said I would accompany you, did I not? Oh no. True. But I would much prefer that we take steps to ease this mindset of yours. Well then, stalemate. And with Sylvain, of course. I'd better avoid the training grounds. I swear his highness never sleeps. You're out late, Sylvain. Is it safe to assume you've been wildly carousing with women? I'm afraid that behavior simply will not Damn do. Damn it, Sylvain. Ah, your highness. Hello. No, I was not wildly carousing with women. There was only the one. Let's just forget you saw me. Agreed? Unfortunately, I can't do that. It's time someone talked some sense into you. And it seems the task has fallen to me. Matri, the voice of reason? I'm not saying you can't enjoy yourself at night. This is a but hell of a development. You must learn the art of moderation. Again and again, you end up wandering the streets until the early morning. Okay, I get it. I don't need one of your lectures. I've got them all memorized anyway. I promise I'll be better in the future. I'll stop going out at night. I'll focus more on my studies. And in return, you'll go into town with me. And we'll invite some cute girls to dinner. Oh no. Shall we shake on it? The way your mind works absolutely confounds me. How did you even arrive at such a notion? You need to get out more. Naive and uptight is no way to live your life. <laughs> Naive and uptight? <laughs> yes, well, compared to you, I imagine I'm downright run of the mill. I'm not so sure. Most men are experienced enough to know not to give a dagger <laughs> to the girl they... Will you never let that rest? It was many years ago. Perhaps a good knock on the head will help you to finally forget about it. With your brute strength, yes. a knock on the head could knock the life right out of me. <laughs> Give a dagger to the girl you like. Temper, your highness. So how about this? I'll try to behave, and you'll try to loosen up. <sighs> if I do as you wish, will you truly promise to improve your behavior? what I just say? Of course I'll behave. A knight of Fargus never goes back on his word. Uh, what about you? Course. I want to see you with a girl on your arm. I am a man of my word. I will attempt to do as you ask. But you had better uphold your end of the bargain as well. Seriously? <laughs> yeah, I'll believe it when he introduces me to the lucky girl. Of course. Oh, Dimitri, you always take even the silliest things so very seriously. This should be fun. Of course. All right. He's got one of Sylvain. Nice. Wow, Ash. Training again? You're taking this whole night thing pretty seriously. It's just my daily training. Maybe you could stand to be a little more eager yourself? If I want to be a great knight, I've got no choice but to put the effort in. No choice? I think you're making life too difficult. Knights don't have to be perfect. They should be All good. All I'm saying is I've seen some pretty sloppy knights out there. That's not going to be me. I'm going to be a proud knight, virtuous and gallant. Virtuous and gallant? Are you kidding me? If you just ride around being virtuous, people will get fed up. They'll boot you out of town. It's never wrong to have virtue, not even if it means being made an outcast. Interesting idea. Ash is a good. You think very highly of this whole virtue thing. Say, have there been any knights who became great just by thinking highly of themselves? Think on this. Knights are supposed to protect people and earn their admiration. Isn't that right? Well, yes. So what are you saying I should do? Seize people's hearts! What do you mean? Ah. You want people to love you? Offer them something they haven't got. Guess what that is? It's you, Ash. They don't have you. They don't have your heart. Get out there, buddy. Be valiant. Help people. Here, I'll show you how it works. Ah. Uh. Sylvain. A lesson of Sylvain people. is Ash. Hit hey on there, this cutie. person. You seem to have lots of bags there. They must be heavy. My name's Sylvain. Let me help you out. Are these going in the warehouse? Oh. Helping out those. Okay, in the that's good. I guess that's a good start. No thanks necessary. It's been enough just to be able to talk to you. Well, if you insist. How about we go get some tea? It must be fate that we met like this. I'd like oh, to get no. to know you. Great night, huh? Why does Sylvain remind me of Axel 
from uh, Kingdom Hearts. To do is flirt with women. But more of a womanizer. No, I can't allow this. I have to stop him. That's right, Ash. Stop him from uh, obtaining Kingdom Hearts. <sighs> that was quite a sigh. What's wrong, Ingrid? Tell me, Sylvain. What am I to you? You're my friend. One of my oldest, in fact. An old friend, is it? Then why must I clean up the casualties left behind by your... your skirt chasing? <laughs> Nobody Man, it's just been Slaughter Sylvain <laughs> hour. I thought you enjoyed it. Besides, you're real good at it. I'm excited <laughs> to continue working with you. Do you mean to imply you have no intention of acting a bit more respectably? Uh, of course not. Please don't yell like that. Everybody's staring at us. When you were eight, you came on to my sweet, sweet granny! My granny! <laughs> Come on! I was eight, and she was gor- That was a long time ago! Sylvain hit on Ingrid's grandmother? Wow. People can hear you! Please be quiet! When you were ten, we went to that harvest festival, and you started making eyes at a scarecrow! <laughs> a scarecrow? Wait a second. That was just an accident. A tragic, tragic accident. When you were 15, you sought, relentlessly, might I add, to involve yourself with Lord Gwendol's daughter. Who do you suppose made peace with the Furious Lord, despite having nothing to do with it? Hmm? Me. Always me. Always for you. Every time. What a jerk. Damn. You know what? This conversation is over. I'm done. My point is that this has to end. Not later, but now. Fine. I promise I'll try to change. Are you happy now? No. Ingrid will never be. And best friends. That shopping trip took longer than expected, didn't it, Mercy? It truly did. You bought just about everything in the place. <laughs> You're so good at deciding the best thing to buy. I sort of wanted it all. I mean, not that I was excessive. I think you bought just about as much as I did. Oh, really? The number of bags you're carrying says otherwise. What? That's... Oh, fine. You got me. It was okay. just having too much fun. I love shopping with you, Mercy. It was fun. It's nice going into town without having to run errands for once. Isn't it? And I'm pretty confident the professor will forgive our little detour. <laughs> this actually reminds me of going to school in Ferdiad. Me too. Mm. It almost feels like that time in our lives was a story from long ago. So much has changed since then. Oh, but there's at least one thing that hasn't changed. Me and you, right? We're the same old friends we always were. Yes. That's just what I was about to say. I've known you so long I can always guess. Mercy, we'll stay friends like this forever, won't we? Is something wrong? You sound worried. Since our time in the capital, so much has happened. We've had to make new lives for ourselves, and we've seen at least as many hard times as good. Nice if things keep changing like this, I wonder if we'll be able to stay the same people we are now. But you can say friends. I wonder right? that too. I don't think everything in the future will be perfect. But it's us, so I'm sure we'll figure it out together, right? How did you know what I was going to say? <laughs> oh, Mercy, I can always guess what you're going to say. Yeah. Oh, it's getting late. We better hurry back before the professor gets angry. The professor is a very forgiving right. man. Run, Mercy! Or woman, depending what? on who you play Wait as. for me, Annie. You know I'm not as fast as you. God damn. That's the end of the support for now. Anyway, I can rearrange some inventory. You. Don't punch quite as hard. I'll give you a training, but practice. You're here to slaughter regardless of what bow you're actually holding, but that's besides the Mission time. Red Canyon.
Thank you so much. Sylvain gets recruited by every. I am grateful. Some way, somehow. I thank you. Sorry, your scenery. we are taking children into battle, are we? I am not certain I will be able to sleep soundly after beholding something like that. I shall allow you to turn back the hands of time. But no, this power is not infinite. We have divine false. We can turn back time. Don't want to. Everyone is here. Map. Dudes. Everything seems bright to me on this TV, but eh, it's probably okay. I know exactly where I'm pointing at. Let's see how that looks. Alright. I think what I'm going is... Yeah, that's probably fine. For arrangement. And let's begin that sure. The Red Canyon. This is the first time I have ever been here. It's like walking through a ruin. Let's get this battle out of the way, Professor. Whoops, I did not mean to skip that. According to our information, there is a back road to the west. You cannot let's zoom in during this second. Approach from the west and the front. If we advance cleverly, we attack from both sides and gain the advantage. I'll leave the rest to you, Professor. But before all else, we'll need to cross the bridge. All right, now we zoom in. You can also see that I gave everybody battalions at some point during the stream and uh, here. And we're gonna zoom. The zoom is fine. I'll give it my all. What should I do? I'll cut through. I'm on it. Here we go. Stay focused. Here goes. Ready. I'll go. Okay. <laughs> he will get away with nothing. Either or here. Who's next? Slow and steady. I know they are just thieves, but this never gets easier for me. Of course. I'm going to use. You weren't ready. Of course. My technique could use some polish. I can't relax here. We need to prepare for our next battle. Everyone here has a unique dialogue for this battle. Did take a little bit of damage. I might as well uh, heal him. Yeah. Thanks. There we go. Build up that relaxing shoe. Wait, what? And eh, whatever.
You know, I probably could have any rallying each turn to build up some support artificially, but... Put that axe. I have to do uh, just uh, punch this guy out. There we go. A threat eliminated. Punch him. Still whole and sound, I hope. I'm gonna give him a plant's prize. Much appreciated. spells now. Use some fire here. Yeah. Yes. Glad that he's going for uh Ash. He's going for that is because that means that either one of them is going to be hurt so maybe. that said I'll put him here and I have him equipped Oh god. That's a kill. No way he's getting shot today. Alright. Never doubted you. Well then. And Dimitri. Right. This will damn near kill a man with just a throwing stick. Oh. Wasn't worth using weapon durability for, so I hope the goddess blesses them to rest in peace. Yeah, I'm sure it's exactly gonna happen. They're not very brave men. As long as use steel bows, it's like an extra tax from the iron one. We stole this treasure. It's all ours. There's no way we're gonna give it up to some knights. Too bad. Because you are gonna give it up to some knights. 
specifically to these ones. Yes. Okay. L. He'll probably attack Ash because Ash can't exactly counteract him, but. Lines that one. Have him go there to prevent the flank from occurring. You. There to discourage uh, someone going there. Huh, that's fine. You'll get attacked, sure, but you'll be fine. It'll be okay. Kill that piece. Please. Funny thing is that Ash can just uh, go and lock that chest with me. You want the draw in the. Roger it's done. There we go. My thanks. Duster. Keep the gauntlets on. All right, so the archer would go for ring. As well, equip the sword while around. Use caution. Let's use one. Ineffective. And to do with this. Destroy this guy. This punching is crazy. So much slaughter. 
A threat eliminated. I actually have to pull him back so he doesn't hide all the muffler. It all comes down to this. Uh, of course, here he is in the cabin. Of course, I was ahead. Glad the Ash was out of range. Had to occur. Alright. Eh. We'll take him out. Whether with that or with uh, Sylvain. Yes. Be Took gone. out by the shins. I like how this. Orange bullion. I forgot to throw the other bully in India. Sorry. Bully me. Put on sort it. Yes. I'm getting the hang of this. I'll move him a little bit forward to grab this item. And I'll have Felix uh, pop up this floor. You're weak. There we go. I can feel the difference. Finished already? I was hoping for more of a challenge. Of course you. Quite helpful. In our expect that vulnerary uses were placed, but eh, whatever. It's fine. Thanks. I'll cut through. Keep that on. Thank you. The mop up here. Felix will probably decimate this guy. Or not, actually. I thought he was going to double hit. I guess not. Eh, fine. It's okay. That means that Annie can finish him. Finish him with a gust of wind. Which is just a destructor disc. Oh, thank Yeah, I'm, I'm sure you are. So fierce sounding. Not real. Who 
one here is six. Except four. There's no healers around this flank. Culinary usage is a good idea. I probably could have just had Felix clip his bow and attack back. I'm gonna attack him with his bow. He'll kill him. Just fine. And not even get hit by that Next time, bring your friends. Like this. Point blank fire. There we go. Had to be done. That's a weird level up. At least his strength was I'm getting much better. Yes. Instead of the knights means they've underestimated me. Big mistake. Okay, Mr. Pump. Can you catch a frisbee? Doesn't look like you can. Enemy phase. Oh yeah, I forgot. He is on a uh, recovery circle. So, doing partial damage is not the... Will just be undone easily. Well, that means that Felix can uh, shoot a bow at him, I guess. And hit him with the uh, increased effect from his crest. Okay. There's a disc again. Presser has plenty of time to level up soon. Best chance to hit. Perfect. Down you go. I should have never listened to that idiot. What a mistake. Yes. Hmm. I'm not at my best today. Hmm. Could have been better. We have defeated the thieves. We'll follow the knight's instructions for what to do next. You led us well, Professor. Yes. And turn and turn, first with five. MVP. Yes. I mean, it wasn't strictly necessary as he was already maxed. That works too. Oh, well, that's flooring. It's a me.
Hmm. I wonder why it is that you recall this place. You must be weak of heart. Each time I speak, it scares you so. Although the battle's at an end, do not feel too at ease. Mm. Well, anyhow, I am quite fascinated by this place. As far as I can tell, this is your first time here. How very odd. I wonder if somehow my memories have... Mm. Hmm. I must admit, I am unsure. Beyond the name and the strange feeling of familiarity, I can't seem to remember anything about this place. Here it is. And yet, a great depth of emotions tied to that sense of familiarity. Like joy and sorrow, pain Amen. and love, and all things Thanks. in between. If I was somehow here before, I wonder what took Place. Professor, we should return to the monastery soon. We're all ready for the journey. Hmm. It is time to depart. But know that time reveals all things. One day I will remember that which I have lost. Um, very well. Oh, Hopefully. by the way, it seems you've earned my gratitude. The thieves who came here are no more. sure myself mm. yet I am grateful all the same in any case you must become accustomed to my voice if you fall down with shock each time I speak that just won't do of course not that's a terrible oh, idea. you think you're standing strong <laughs> of course you are it was a jest an app wouldn't be too bad though We're finally back. I'll leave the report to Lady Rhea in your hands, Professor. Of course. Huh. Edelgard. Does the Black Eagle House have a mission to see to? Remember, on a real battlefield, one can never tell what's to come. Oh, wow. You can never dismiss the possibility of the worst-case scenario. Take care, Edelgard. There's no need to state the obvious, Dimitri. But tell me, why the concern? Perhaps you doubt my abilities? If so, your lack of insight your, is disappointing. Your ability to assume things That's is disappointing. That's not what I meant. If I've offended you, I hope you'll accept my apology. Don't worry about it. Well. Professor, we must hurry. Everyone's waiting on me. I suppose I should be off too. Try not to let her get to you, Dimitri. I promise you, there's no need for concern. Uh, of course. Hmm. Puppy love. <laughs> now that's a lark. I had no idea you had a sense of humor, Professor. I'll tell you all about it some other time. Maybe. Oh no. So you have safely disposed of those bandits. I pray that their souls find salvation. But why did they target the students to begin with? We must further investigate the true cause of all that took place. Until we know more, I ask that you support the students and relieve them of any unnecessary worry. Good. I have high expectations for you. Whoa. By the way, how was your time in Xanadu? Legend has it, in ancient times, a goddess alighted upon this world in that very canyon. For a goddess from the heavens, Xanado could only have been a temporary haven. David. Long ago, the divine Seros received a revelation from the goddess. A gift to help guide the lost. The goddess is always watching over Fodland from her kingdom above. However, in ancient times, the goddess graced this world with her presence 
and offered salvation to the people here. She is the mother of all life, the arbiter of every soul. I see. During your time here, I pray that you come to devote yourself to the teachings of Seros. Uh, Lady Rhea, I am sorry to interrupt. There is something I must ask about in regard to those bandits. As you wish. We shall continue our discussion when next we meet. Of course. A goddess? I have no memory of her. But then, I have no memory at all. Oh, how bothersome. It is as though I know, and yet I don't. Perhaps Xanado was my home back when the goddess walked the land. If so, what does that make me now? A ghost? Uh. Well, are you simple? That's impossible. <laughs> I am most certainly alive. <laughs> of course, we also have the mystery of why I'm here with you. Is it somehow connected? Perhaps some past regret is stopping me from moving on, and now I'm forced to stay with you instead. No, that's not it. I can't believe in such a meaningless existence. I... Uh... <sighs> He's tired. Of course. Let her sleep. You teach people things that did it. Part 1. White Clouds. Garland Moon. Mutiny in the Mist. When the warm winds blow from the sea to the south of Adrestia, residents of Fodlin know that the rainy season is upon them. Before the heavy rains take their toll, young women hurry to pick the last of the white roses. The ivory buds are woven into garlands and given as gifts to close friends or potential lovers. It's Garland Moon, of course. You have a lot of garlands to Also, this tells you more about fishing. It's a lovely time. Okay. Place to explore. You get some money. You have event flag. Professor, I have a new mission for your students. We have received reports that Lord Lonato has rallied troops against the Holy Church of Seros. Lord Lonato is a minor lord of the kingdom. He's been showing hostility toward the church for some time now. A vanguard unit from the Knights of Seros is already on its way to his stronghold, Castle Gaspar. Lord Lenato's army is nothing compared to the knights. It is quite possible the rebellion has already been suppressed. Even so, I would like for your class to travel with the knights' rear guard to deal with the aftermath. War zones are unpredictable. We do not expect you will have cause to battle, but be prepared for the worst. Uh, of course. Excuse me. You sent for me, Lady Rhea? This is Catherine. She will be leading the knights Catherine. and you will be accompanying Nice to meet you. We've heard a lot about you. If you need anything, just ask. She is one of our bravest knights, and that is no small feat. Only an exceptional few have what it takes to join the Knights of Seros. Well, then. This mission should prove useful in demonstrating to the students how foolish it would be to ever turn their blades on the church. Ah. Uh, the solitary is fine. <laughs>
It's Sylvain's birthday. Uh, sure. Thank you so much. You, you get flowers. Everyone gets flowers. Always. Play online to see behavior plays around the world. You can see what percentage of players you have to. He's not even saying what he needs to his popular. It might tell you whether you should explore, battle, seminar, or rest for some reason. Anyway. We have support. We'll crank these things out now. At this time of year, the fish are fat. Simply grilling them will bring out their best flavor. Steaming them with herbs is delicious, too. Wow, you know a lot about this. I'm learning so much from you to do. Were you a cook at the castle in Ferdiad? No. I was not a cook there. Did your family own an eatery of some kind? No. My sister and I helped with cooking at home. Wow, that's all? I thought I was confident about my skills, but next to you, I feel like an amateur. Hey, could you give me some advice about other kinds of meat besides fish? Ash. Yes to do? <sighs> Why do you spend time with me? We're friends, right? Yes, we're friends. I just want to get to know you better. Is that so odd? I am from Dusker. Dusker. So, look at me. I came from a life of poverty. I, I think we have a lot in common. Whoops. I was lucky to even be let in here to study with all these high-class people. I think we have a lot in common. Being poor and being from Dusker are two different things. Oh, I, I know. But we can still be friends, can't we? You are a peculiar person. <laughs> so I'm told. Well then. Oscar. Dear Goddess, please protect us. Mercedes. Oh, to do. Was there something you needed? His Highness sent me to collect you. I see. I'll be with you in just a moment. I'm almost finished here. You were praying. I was. Praying for everyone's safety. And praying for good desserts tonight. And that my next exam goes well. The Fodlan goddess will accept prayers of any sort. <laughs> it's true. I've thought the same thing myself. That reminds me to do. Weren't you born in Dusker? Yes. Do the people of Dusker pray to the goddess, too? Dusker had a very different view of religion. Oh? Mm. In Dusker, there were many gods. The sky had a god. The earth had a god. We made offerings to the war god for victory in battle. Held feasts for the sea god to calm the waves. So your people prayed to different gods depending on what they needed? Correct. Well then. Your beliefs sound so different from ours. Tell me more. Why? Dusker is a ruin. Dusker may be gone, but you're still here. Would you tell me more about it the next time we meet? <sighs> if you insist. Really? That would be great. Time I'm for some learning. I'm looking hearing more soon. Dusker is gone. But I'm still here. Ah. And we got Faze and Ingrid. They can move on to Night doing shenanigans. Suppose I'd better wrap up. Good work with your training today, Ingrid. Here's something to wipe up the sweat. Whoa, Mercedes. Hi. Hello. How long have you been? Um. Thank you. You're very welcome. I've been here since you started. Not long. Huh. Well, my apologies for not having noticed you. I get so caught up in training, you know. But why are you here? I can't imagine it was too terribly interesting watching me. I disagree. I just couldn't help but admire your training technique. I have to say, you are very impressive. I'm nowhere near as graceful as you. Graceful? 
I wouldn't say that, but thank you. If I'm to be honest, I'm the one who admires you. Goodness me, how so? You're always so put together. You hold yourself with such poise and have such a keen eye for fashion. I mean, even the handkerchief you handed me smells like... Lavender, is it? It's just lovely. That perfume is a favorite of mine. I'm so glad you like it. Even the fact that you thought to put perfume on your handkerchief is delightfully foreign to me. I'd mm. never have thought of that. I'll gladly share some with you. You're welcome to come visit my room whenever you'd like. We can have tea and chat. How does that sound? Uh, that sounds really nice. Yes. <laughs> Sipping tea and having a chat. It's unlike me, but it sounds lovely. From now on, we'll meet up whenever we have time. We can go right now if you're free. Oh, no need to trouble yourself and rearrange things for me. It's no trouble at all. You'll never know if you're the type who enjoys chatting over tea if you never try. <laughs> of course. All right then. Y'all sit down and have tea. Do you really know if you like tea? Good point. Anyway, let's explore. You can also take a look and see what's going on here. Goldfish, Blessing of the Light, Sweet Tooth, and the Choir Festival. Let's explore. We can also recruit people elsewhere. And also, self is on a room for some reason. You have spent quite some time in here engaging in such idle chatter. Do you not know that we have not a moment left to waste? You must try harder from now on. All right. We can teleport to random places. Also, we can go to the Knight's Hall now. Or at least walk there, I guess. We also have a couple places up on the second floor. Let's go to the fishing pond. I desired fresh air. Hmm. Hmm. I have a favor to ask. Ah, uh, to the guildmaster. Down here. Also, Hilda is here. No. What do you require? Well, we're gonna price what we've got currently. Thank you. Battalions from various territories gather at the guild. There are even some that aren't affiliated with the Church of Seros. As we are allowed to hire them, you should visit the guild soon and come to your own conclusions. As they fight, battalions will lose endurance. When that happens, you can replenish their endurance by visiting the Battalion Guild in the market. Maybe... Basically, every once in a while, go to the Battalion Guild and replenish your troops. Maybe hire new ones. And at the end of the game, hire all of them. Professor, your clothes are a bit dirty. If you don't pay attention to your hygiene, the girls won't like you. I hate when my clothes get dirty. That's one of the many reasons I find it best to train as little as possible. Hey, it's not your sheer laziness? Okay. Hi That's there, fair. Oh no. Since we're heading to Castle Gaspar, that means we'll be passing through Magdred Way. The road is well known for its beautiful surroundings. Depending on and the time for of being year, called it can be incredibly Way. foggy though. When it's like that, you can't enjoy the lovely scenery. 
Lucky for us, it shouldn't be too foggy while we're there. Not that we'll have time for sightseeing, anyway. Of course. Well... What? Gatekeeper. Greetings, Professor. Nothing to report. Have you talked with Catherine yet? <laughs> if the knights are the cream of the crop, she's the cream of the cream. Oh, and that relic of hers. I hear it's nothing short of amazing. Wow, kid. Floss your teeth. Maybe. Possibly. Well, okay. We might as well visit the area next to the Knights Hall. Oh, Knights Hall and Stable. We get them to see both at once. Eat. Anyway. And is there. <laughs> of course you don't trust the Western Church, they're from the West. And the night salt. We'll go here a moment. We're gonna accept this quest, it's over yonder. From settings. I've heard whispers about Lord Lenato. They say he's a very kind and gentle lord. Why would such a kind man suddenly raise an army? Oh, Professor, you were working late last night, weren't you? You shouldn't overdo it. A ghost might rise up from the well to get you if you stay up too late. Or so indeed. Ah, uh, ghosts. I have a favor to ask of you. Talk to the counselor. Good time. We're going on a mission with the knights, right? I wonder if... Oh, sorry, it's nothing. I was just wondering if someone I've been searching for might be among them. Thank you. I'm definitely gonna find him one of these days. Yes, you should. Maybe. I think I'm gonna go accept the quests that are upstairs before we go to the cathedral. Oh, and Dorothea. Uh. Don't worry, we'll recruit you soon. Second floor. has so many breathtaking works of art. I feel like I'm living in a museum. Each piece can teach you about Icon? styles and techniques from a thousand years ago. Oh yes, very much. I'm from a family of merchants, so I've been able to see a lot of art. We'll try to recruit you later. Don't leave Bondi quite enough for that to work. Pointing a sword at the Holy Church of Seros is akin to pointing a sword at the goddess herself. Meeting out appropriate punishment to the sinful. It is a sacred duty with which we have been entrusted. As a member of the church yourself, I hope that you will take that to heart. Don't worry, we, uh, will I? Uh, it's time to go away. All right, Manuel has a quest. Did you hear? There's news of someone in the kingdom raising an army. The kingdom, the empire, the alliance. They do love a good war, don't they? Always. Spilling the blood of young men and women. And for what? Just to enjoy the horror of it? Would you be so kind as to do me a favor? Dorsey, fairly trained for Manuela. Okay, let us uh, work on our stuff. I still have much. To I simply must thank you, Professor. Yes. Incomplete. Well. Eh, whatever. Let's see. 
Castle Gaspar, eh? I've been there once before, many years ago. It was by request of the son of that family, Kristoff, uh, I think it was. Ah. Uh. I have a request. All right. Thanks for your help. Oh yeah, we picked up a flask. Gift out here increases score points. So that was good. And things like gift will increase motivation. Also, lost items will also increase motivation. They belong to specific people. And also, we can learn how to be a better leader from him. From our dad. Practice yields results. Of course. Moss being weird and more. What is he? Professor, I heard that you made battle alongside Catherine. Even among the knights, she is something special. A holy knight who is able to wield a hero's relic. Still, she can be a mite difficult. Well... Th I'm guessing that William Relics is not something that happens too often in Saros. Catherine does, though. Oh, she can also As teach. Of, the church yourself. of course. Teach me how to face. All right. Hey. And we can trash all to the cathedral now to talk to that counselor. Over here. Counselor man. Each month you'll approach counselor of concerns. Satisfy them with your responses. Hmm. Yes. Thank you so much. Impress Claude. There are two more notes. We're not saves coming this, so well. Hmm. Okay, that worked. Say he's liked it. Hell yes. Hmm. We see these specifics of that. Back certain hands by over the nature of the event. All oh, right. That means the effects of this should be enhanced the way I think they should be. You. And, uh, I'm gonna say you. I'll keep my voice down. Don't want people thinking I'm vying for attention. But how loud is too loud? Singing's okay, but I should really have a cute dance to go along with it. Of course. Inner support. I have a support option. I think it's Dorothea. Yes, it is. Y 
you can uh, do. There's Hammond. So, you are able to see on the map certain locations where if you walk to it, you'll be able to trigger the support discussions. If it's yourself. We can go visit Dorothea now. Well, I had fun today. Of course, you want to see me again, yes? Uh, of course. I'd love to, Dorothea. <laughs> well, until we meet again. Oh, hello, Professor. Were you watching that? Uh, sure, we'll be blunt. Yes. Is there a problem with that? Look, I know what I'm doing. My claim as a diva won't last forever, after all. I must look to the future. As a man, you may not feel so rushed about these things, but I know my beauty will eventually fade. Well. You? Really? I never would have guessed. Anyway, I'm not just playing games with these boys. This is for my future. You have no right to object. I very much want to find a good partner here at the Academy. Someone who will take care of me for the rest of my life. Oh god. Finding someone to take care of me? <laughs> of course it is. Who could ask for anything more? Anyway, I value your opinion, Professor, but I won't have you interfering with my life plans. Unless you'd like to take care of me into my old age. That would be something, eh? How about it, Professor? Uh, let's, uh... I wasn't... You aren't being serious, are you? I was just teasing. <laughs> or did you really just consider spending your whole life with me? If you did, that... That actually makes me... It makes me happy. I had no idea you might look at me that way. Well, she is a fan favorite, you so there is that to account it. for. You might even be blushing a bit. Have I embarrassed you? If so, I'm very, very sorry. I should be going anyway. I'll see you later, Professor. Of course. Alright, now we are going to... Oh, hi, Seth. If you have a moment, I would like a word. It has been brought to my attention that certain individuals have been making advances toward Flame. You wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would you? I don't, actually. If you do see anyone getting too close with Flame, please inform me of it at once. Okay. Use a different response when you are met. Got it. That was good. Good training. I'm sorry, but I must vent to someone, Professor. You're familiar with Manuela's slovenly behavior, yes? That I've woman, heard. She borrowed a book last week and returned it with stains of unknown origin on the cover and several pages either folded or torn. Just now, she dropped a sandwich on the floor, picked it up, and kept eating. When she saw my shock, she said simply, three second rule. Ugh. How can three second rule? It transcends all boundaries. It is here. Also, might as well train up my uh, reason while we're right here. And there is. Eight. We have four activity points left. And we have a sweet teeth 
Tooth special. We're going to uh, work on Ash and This looks delicious. Let's eat. Ooh, <laughs> I love this stuff. Did you know that? No. Oh yeah, the garden house. We have things. All right. Have or look to see if there are any seats first off. Now we done. Gardening. We'll try that. Eh, could be worse. Who we'll uses a bone meal today? Eh, we'll wait. This flower is one that is eating insects. Is that factual too? I am wondering who watches over the plants in Fodlin. Thanks for the lurk. See that. Late night work. See. That makes sense. Ah. Alright. You have neither of these things. We'll give you something later. No. Okay. Well. You could use a booster. There are times when one must take up their blade, even if there's no chance of winning. But this, it's downright senseless. Lord Lenato knows better. If he had enough allies to back his rebellion, it would be a different matter. Ah, my apologies. I was just thinking aloud. This whole situation is a bit too strange for my liking. Mm. Even with the necessary preparations in place, there is always a chance that something unexpected will occur. Please be ready for anything, Professor. Of course. I appreciate it. We gave him a wet stuff. He likes it. We give people gifts, their motivation increases, obviously. As His Highness is strong, but on the front lines, anything can happen. Losing him would be devastating for Fargus. I hope the church understands that. All right, you are happy. I forgot. Somebody yawned. Lorenz. It is a noble's duty to protect the common folk, not to endanger them by rallying armies in such a feckless and improper manner. Abuse of that kind is no better than slavery. A proper noble must guard the people from such a fate, wouldn't you say? Precisely why true nobility is well respected. We'll... Oh wait, we can't go to the graveyard. The cemetery. Okay. Whatever, man. Yeah. Anyway. Okay. Talk to Dorothy a little bit more. Are you going to fight alongside the Knights of Saros? Hmm. Let me know if you meet anyone I might be interested in, okay? Hmm. I'll be sure. 
here. Oh, thank you, Professor. Have a bear. Okay. Well. Let's go search for some more random blue things we can pick up. Find more blue things, that'll be perfect. Right here. Oh, that's fishing spots. Okay. Talk about clawing the schemes later. Okay. Well, nothing in here. Fernand is. Do 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 do. That's a thing. And draw a map. All right, I know who that belongs. Just there. Oh, she's up there. I see. Wow. I'm studying here so I can be the best there is, just like Captain Gerald. Do you think I've got it in me to be a top tier mercenary professor? I do. Though it's about so much more than being rich. It's about honor. Honor. Here, have a hand-drawn oh, map. That's mine. Thanks so much for finding it. Nice. Oh, hey, there's a port. And these two. Oh, Ash, are you here to study too? I am. It's quiet here. Easier to concentrate. <sighs> it really is. Hey, would you like to study together? We can help each other out if we get stuck. Oh yes. We'll get a lot more done working together. Eh. Yeah. Uh, hmm. What's the matter, Ash? This question's got me stumped. A ballista inside a castle is ready to fire at enemies outside. What angle should be used for the shot? Mm. Assume the ballista is the same as those in Garrig Mach. Ignore the effects of wind. This is for defensive strategy, isn't it? Why is it so complicated? Don't you just aim and fire? Hmm. hmm. It may help to focus on maximizing target accuracy to reduce your miss rate. To start, let's sort out the setup. Let's see. Using let's these use ballista math. specifications, if the ballista corals follow this trajectory, they'll hit the enemy lines, right? Oh, that makes sense. Because the enemy line will be here. That's it. Okay, now try using that same technique and applying it to this other problem. If the walls are this high and the enemy lines are at that distance... Oh, I think I see! I knew you'd get it. Wow, I didn't expect math of all things to be useful in a siege. Math is useful for a thing. This is tough. Numbers are not my strong suit. But this really is the sort of thing you have to know if you want to command troops. That's true, but not everyone is good with numbers. That's why we have tacticians do these calculations for us, or prepare them before we go to battle. A century ago, the Empire's mathematicians played a huge role in the Battle of the Wall of Fodlan. I had no idea. Hey, you really know what you're doing, Annette. You think so? Definitely. You've obviously done a lot of studying. I really admire that. I suppose I have. Studying is a necessity if you want the advantage over your enemies. <laughs> but necessity aside, it's nice to hear you say that. <laughs> All right. Well. And nobody has support in other houses. To know. Well, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the cafeteria again. See who else needs, uh... Well, Felix needs to be pumped up. And we can...
Oh, he's not a fan of the sweets, so... Grab him. And I'm also gonna grab Leon. That looks appetizing. That looks delicious. Goddess, forgive me. I've just got to indulge. Of course. And we will go chef or cook a meal. Ash, cook me a thing. Cook me some jelly. I love to cook. What are we making today? That's so. I have a lot of experience in the kitchen. I can make just about anything. Oh yes. Wow. Counting on it. Yes. Eloise is here. Alright. Well, uh, what can we learn from that guy? Oh, Catherine. We'll go learn from Catherine, I guess. And there's a lot of blue things. Gold longsword. Tired overcoat. A wooden button. Well. Impressive. Catherine, hmm? Her skill is impressive, I'll admit. Hmm. So is her sword. But I think she's hiding something. Nobody knows anything about her past. You should spar with her. She's strong. Stronger than you are, I'd bet. Well. Oh. I know nothing. Here to train? Catherine time. You really are as hardworking as they say. Spoken like a true hard worker. And we can learn how to sword better from. We might as well pump that up a little bit. Impressive. I'm sure we'll be back here. Truck manual. Well, I have uh, Sylvain and Ingrid working on their feet. I think I'm going to go into uh, you. And I'm going to start working on the uh, tools that will bring you. Hmm. I'm not sure what to make it. Well, you start on flight again. Wow, I see. Hey. Got it. Good to go. And we then dump a point into axes. I could also theoretically just make him somebody use his magic later, but eh, nah, I may. You know that she's learning that. I think I'm not gonna have her. Actually, eh, maybe I will. I don't know yet. I'll work on her floor. Looks like I. Ah. We'll do that. I appreciate. Faster we can get to that, the faster we can get her to. Conquer the skies. Looks like I. I'm certain I've. Elias. Meanwhile, Dimitri, I'll make you learn how to ride. This will be useful. That was. All right. Three more sessions with you, and you'll be a riding fiend.
And it's time to work on your sword survivors. This could be useful. Well, that worked. Quite intri- Quite intriguing. Thank you. All right. You can learn a skill from the lands. And if I intend to have you do the path I want you to go on, that might be a good idea. I've learned. I've learned a lot. Yes. You have. You'll learn that passively from that. What we're going to do is we're going to fuck you in. And I guess I'll start working on your faith so that you can also be a good mage. Yes. Yes. Too. I learned a lot. Am I making? Yes. Settings. I'll keep working on your bow, only to give you. Well, I think I'll eventually do a few. It's gonna be like a magic bow or something. That way, you can do you think yes, use your magic stat in order to bow things good. Yes. Very good. No more for now. We'll keep working on their flight. Let's see here. Yeah, we can do that. That way you can get to a level 10 pretty easy. I have a question. Alright, question away. I just not before take. Then you give the swords, man. I think my time is necessary for practicing sword blade technique. Why should I waste my time attending lectures? Just to improve my magic skills from mediocre to average. All right. I think it'll make you a stronger swordsman. There is. I see. Ability. Anger degrees. Birthday. Lorenz's birthday. Thank you. Sure, have flowers. I'm a generous man. Ugh, I'm with Ingrid. I'm not gonna get away with anything. Stop messing around and get moving. You don't work, you don't eat. Of course. Fine, let's do this. <sighs> Seems we finally finished. That's it, I'm done. No more work for me. We've heard this one in, at least once during this stream. I've deepened my understanding. Got it. Good to go. And that, I think, affected Ingrid, actually. The, uh, Felix boost. Yeah, that's good. Alright. Well. Here we are. A lot of people are battling. Well, I think we two are going to battle. We'll be getting meat no matter which one we go to. Let's go battle the Empire. I have gratitude.
You need to miss, but not really. Not yet, anyway. So I think what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna do this battle for a stream. Then I'm probably going to call the stream an end. Do a little bit of grinding off screen. And we'll be back. And I'll be back with you another time to finish this up. For now, let's finish this one. And look at what we got going on. A lot of... That one's level 9. Hopefully this wasn't a mistake. Perfect. Yeah. That setup is fine. Well, Alright, we are your flash battalions. We're good. Fight time. Stay focused. I'm on it. Ready. I'll keep working on our sword right here. I'll give it my all. Ash will come and assist, I guess. Here goes. Um. All right, rally ho. What should I do? I'll go. Here we go. And we will just end right here. Well, that was a healing unit. strike. Nice. Not setting a very damn it, man. Kick him in the face. Now there's a guy attacking from a range of three. Taught them a lesson. Should I have held back? With a critical hit. Never doubted you. Yes. I'll cut through. I like that lesson. The painful one. Seven B tree. I'm getting stronger. Well, well, we'll destroy him either way. Sufficient. We get a good chance to crit. In fact, we did trigger a crit. Oh god. Next time, bring your friends. Stronger, huh? We'll see. Well done.
Well, let's see here. Friend Gale will one shot this one. In fact, that's exactly what we're gonna do. That worked out. Feeling stronger. Alright, I have a grid. Hurgle frag this one. We'll have Ash finish him. There we go. I must steal him down a little bit. Is this a joke? Yes. Ha ha ha. One punch. In the room. Got it. Make a meal down. That that bandit was just foolish. No Throwing an arrow at somebody that can hit you twice with uh, fire. Exactly. That was just poor performance on part there. One guy can still shoot settees, but the other hand. Well, disturbance will just outright annihilate. It's kind of dumb, but we can also add again. Eh, we'll show off a rat strike. And a crest does more damage. You weren't ready. Well then. My that was a good low. Oh, I didn't realize that guy was still there. Well, that's okay. We can get him. We can get him. The fight continues. Of course. I'll stick with it. Not bad. That way he can just be one shot by somebody. The vein. He uses a weaker For the one that'll be breaking sooner. Be gone. Be gone. But okay, so then. Whoops. Oh well. I slipped. Nothing's ever good. Yeah, not good enough. Yeah. 
You didn't need the nice rocks of that one. You weren't you need healing. Alright. Well, it's Iron Bow at any rate. On second thought, heal Felix. Yeah. Well, we could just outright obliterate home training goblins. We're gonna do that. Yeah, he doesn't end up shooting Mercedes later. Give up. Not good enough. Dang it, man. I was hoping that like crit or something, but that works too. Here, have a steel bow. And normally a not wise decision, but hey, to lose. it worked this time. Use caution. And you're about to run out of iron light. Eh. Have a javelin. And we'll train bow this uh, guy to death. There we go. Take a nice nap. Another step forward. Of course. Next time, bring your friends. And Felix is taking heads. I have improved. Luckily, this is on normal mode and also casual because I am a scrub. So even if Dimitri does die painfully here, we'll be okay. Yeah, we're okay. No choice. Meanwhile. Some more last minute healing experience. Heavy move in. Throw a javelin in the direction. Why not? And uh, wait. I'll, uh, win. Just a simple win. What's done is done. A change for the better. Use some gold in bear. Dusker bear. From Dusker. All right, so we're safe. And I'm gonna pick this up again. 
another time. I'll do a little bit of grinding off screen, obviously, so that you guys don't have to wait terribly long for things to But, next time I pick up, we'll be doing a set of classes, and we'll get to the next chapter's mission. Anyway, thank you guys for coming out today to this, uh, wondrous place. Onaz. Dreamland. And let's see here. Hmm, is he going? No, he's. Could go. Or there we go. Sounds available. Thank you for coming out today. We'll see you again. Y'all have a wonderful night. And be sure to stick around for Overwatch.